Guys, I want you to imagine something. It's uh, two o'clock at night. Um, you walk around in Amsterdam. Nobody's around. Only a couple of street lamps and the beautiful light mirroring in the canals. Everything else is dark and quiet. And it's a little bit like um, a theater stage, um, hours after uh, the show. Um, nobody's there anymore. Some spotlights are still on. But can you feel the temptation to sneak up to the stage and uh, just recite a poem or um, say something stupid to these empty chairs in front of you? So at least that what was what I felt when I was uh, running around in Amsterdam that uh, special night. And that was the reason why I started to get into street art. But I didn't want it to work on uh, walls or on the floor. I wanted to use these beautiful street lamps as an urban gallery, and I wanted to use um, the night and the darkness as the setting around my artwork. As you can see on these photos, I managed to do so, and that was due to a certain material that I found worked perfectly. That's great that he tapes me. <laughs> <laughs> Because, I I'm, I'm keep going, right? Um, yep. The material I found was actually taped. Not that one, but this one here. Just normal um, brown translucent packing tape. And I take this and tape layers of layers on pieces of plexiglass. I cut out certain parts, I peel off certain parts, until um, a graphic picture uh, occurs. Um, you can see how that looks on a street lamp on these photos. Um, I also brought you one example with me. Uh, I hope I'm not too sweaty from all the waiting. But the thing is, uh, it's pretty boring without light, but once you put it up into the light, I hope you can see the effect. <laughs> it, it starts glowing from inside almost. Um, it's kind of a tricky process to, to explain. It's pretty boring, so I made a video for you to demonstrate how I create these artworks. All right, it's a little crooked, but um, I'm working actually on a window here, and uh, it's very fast forwarded. Normally this process takes five days, and uh, around like 20, 25 of these uh, rolls of packing tape. Um, but you can see how I um, put layers of packing tape on a plexiglass, how I peel off parts I don't like, um, and again put other layers on, and that way I can control the light that gets through the packing tape and uh, I can create contrast and add a certain depth to the, to the artwork. The tool I use for, for cutting the, the uh, tape is actually just an ordinary but very sharp uh, cutting knife. But now I'll let you along with the video. So it's a little crooked in this view here, but um, well, some things are cut out. So I show you the next pictures, which depict um, like other tapes I, I made. Something like this here. Well, but I want to talk to you a little bit more about street art, because um, I um, came out with a project a couple of months ago. It's called Stick Together. And the idea was to create small tapes and send uh, into the world. Um, people who receive these stickers can take them and are free to hang them up on street lamps they favor or on any other kinds of urban uh, lights. Um, and that's where the miracle started for me. I thought this is going to be a temporary project. I thought this is just a fun idea. But within weeks, actually, um, it started to um, develop its own life. People from all corners of the world applied for these stickers. Um, but not only that, there were some who came up with their own creations um, and they sent them out to others. Um, there were people posting videos and photos and others who shared their little street adventures online and offline. And so this uh, empty stage I was uh, talking about earlier, 
it started to fill up with more and more people. And it wasn't like a, a performing artist on, the, on, on one side and just like a listening audience on the other side. We all interacted with each other and we all supported and inspired um, each other. And I know that art can do that. I've, I've heard that art uh, can bring people together um, regardless their background. But I've never experienced um, that kind of effect before in my life, in that intensity. And uh, it is a great experience. And uh, I thank everybody who was part of the project so far. And I can just encourage you guys to uh, join if you like. Thank you. You know what? I forgot to, to click, so you see a little bit like these, how these stickers look. I sent out, I'm <laughs> sorry to. All right. <laughs>